Hey, the Dallas show, it sold out, so we added a second show. Got two shows one day, man. Got two shows in Dallas. We coming back to Texas. We going to Austin, Texas. We going to Houston, Texas. San Antonio, Texas. Dallas, Texas. Lubbock, Texas. Go to HawksTwinsTour.com for tickets. Hey, we live, man. Yeah. Just stand back at you, man. What the Del Taco, man? They got nachos over there, man. Take your seatbelt off. They got some nachos over there, man. Like, sip it off. Hold up, man. Let me get a thumbnail, man. Thumbnail, man. Yeah. Why ain't it focusing, man? There you go. Ah. Oh, yeah. Take those jalapenos off. I don't like that. Uh, you know what? Uh, this fork, man. Why did he put a knife in that, man? What am I going to do with this? Stab somebody? <laughs> <laughs> what am I going to do with this, Del Taco? Why y'all putting this with the fork, man? Don't nobody use this, man. Stupid. Take these damn jalapenos off, man. Let's take them off, man. I'm gonna eat one of them, man. I'm gonna leave one of them on there, man. Take them off, man. Throw them off, man. I want no damn jalapeno residue on my stuff. Throw that off, man. Now, I'm gonna take the first bite, man. I'm gonna eat a, eat a jalapeno, man. So don't. Take them off, man. Yeah, what up, man? Here you go. Hey, try that jalapeno, man. It's good, man. I don't like it. Try it, man. I don't want it. We're going to decide what is better, Del Taco or Taco Bell. I think I already know. Me too. But don't tell them yet. Make them wait till the end. Yeah, I'm gonna make you wait. Hell, I might not even tell you. Because yeah, I, I know some of y'all gonna skip to the end. Just to piss you off, I ain't gonna tell you. Maybe I'm gonna man, tell you. need to mix it up a little bit more, man. Maybe I'll tell you midway they through. They got all the damn beans and the beef on one damn chip, man. Yeah, that's a strike there, Del Taco. Man, come on now. Hold up, man. We gonna get this up in now. Gonna get it up in now. Get up in there. I just take the chip like this. Get up in there. Get up in there. Go and get up in there. You know, it just got more beans and cheese on it. You know what? Ain't gonna make you wait. Taco Bell's is way better. Way better, man. It's not even close. Don't get me wrong, it's, it tastes pretty good, but it's decent. Best nachos, man. Taco oh, Bay. You put all the cheese at the bottom. It's like a white cheese. Give me some more. Get out of my ear. It's spicy because of those jalapenos. Mm hmm. All that damn jalapeno residue. I'm going to put that in the bag. I'm going to put that in the bag. Man, they all right, man. They all right, man. They all right, man. Ain't nothing to cry home about, man. Cry home about? What the hell does that mean? Ain't nothing to cry home about. What the hell does that mean? Cry home about? What the? You damn so damn mouth burning. Ain't nothing to run home about. That ain't said? Run home about? Yeah, I'm telling everybody. Figure speech. Ain't nothing to run home about, man. Damn, car sound like a trash can. It's cause it is a damn trash can. <laughs> <laughs> Just bagged up a uh, two weeks worth of fast food videos. <laughs> Ain't that much. Uh. Hey, man. Taco Bell, they, they blow them out the water, man. It's not even close. It's like a different sport. Yeah, it's like apples and uh, testicles. 
<laughs> hey, um, do El Pollo Loco got, got nachos, man? I think they do. We need to try theirs. Because they're more upscale. Maybe they're going to beat Taco Bell. Upscale? Yeah, it's more professional. Man, they just got chicken now, man. But it's more How are they going to be upscale? They just got chicken, though. They got beef? I don't know. We need to check them out. That's why they call it Pollo Loco. There ain't nothing but chicken in there. Yard bird, man. Look at this place, man. Called Liquor World. Las Vegas. Hey. Hey, man. They're all right, man. They're all right, man. I ain't buying them again. If I want some nachos, I'm going to Taco Bell. Eat whatever you want to eat. Yeah. yeah. Tired of this email. Girlfriend is too aggressive in bed. No, man. Come on now. How can a girl be too aggressive in the bed, man? Hold on. How can a girl, unless she's squeezing your balls, like really hard, like she's trying to break them, that's too aggressive. Let me read the email. Like when she's sucking your balls, if she's sucking them like real hard, like it's a damn popsicle, then that's, that's too aggressive. That's painful. Instead of licking your nipples, she's chewing your nipples. That's too aggressive. You like that nipple action, don't you? Yeah, I like some nipple action. It's a hot spot right here, man. Get the fuck off. Right here too, man. Stop, man. Gets my dick hard. Gets my dick so hard it's gonna feel like it's gonna break. What up, twins? My girlfriend of about four months has a fetish where she likes to smack my ass when I'm on top. And when I'm hitting it doggy style, she likes for me to slap her ass. Yeah, she she wants you to buck, be that buck, man. She wants you to be that horse. She see you as a stallion, man. She hits you in the ass, man. Means hit it harder. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Hey! She likes it hard. Her ass is red afterwards and my hands are actually hurting. That's fucking too much. You in there whooping that bitch's ass? <laughs> you know why she liked that, right? Some sorry ass nigga got to her before you did and broke her soul. I'm pretty sure the first guy she ever been with was in now.